Well, Jeff, I'm with you in Taiwan. The last time I spoke with you was kind of on the other side of the pond. Yes. But we wanted to fly all the way across the world to be the very first to showcase this massive five-axis machine. I know you have a range of machines at YCM, and five-axis is, we used to say, we used to say the future. Oh no, oh no, it is, it's it is how we're, yeah. yeah. It is, it's maybe even the yesterday, yeah. not yeah. saying that it's outdated, but we should have bought into it yes. already if we have it. And if our shop That's doesn't right. have five-axis machining, we better get into it immediately. Yes. But this is a big mamma jamma. I know yes. I, I don't use the word mamma jamma a lot, but you have a full <laughs> line of machines. So let's talk about the line of machines and the one we're standing in front of now and right. how it was developed because I know the relationship from factory to friendship and partnership kind of all right. comes together and when it comes to development. Well, YCM is a, is a family oriented business and what we like to do is get the input and the feedback from our family members who we also believe was our customer. So, uh, so this actually came from a dealer and a customer uh, and, and we've developed this because we have our, what we call our CX series of machine, which is a C-frame style of five axis product. Then we move up to the RX range. We have an RX 65 and an RX 65 plus now. And then this jumps us up to an RX 85 and this machine is an RX 100. So basically this has an 800 millimeter table with a thousand size millimeter part size capability. And this puts us in a range of five axes that really our customers need and deserve today. Well, you say this puts us in a range, right? And when I think, when somebody makes a joke with me about, are you ready to start a machine shop? I say, give me the big one, right? And when yeah. I think about give me the big one, sometimes I might want to machine smaller parts as well. I know I always want to do done in ones. I know I always want to be in the five axis world. And I know I always want to do automation. I see a door over here. We can talk about that as well. Yes. So I know certain ingredients to my recipe that I need to have, but yeah. a machine like this, it's a big one, it's right? A big one. Yep. And I think to myself, am I investing, when I invest in a machine like this, am I investing in something that's only gonna be rigid and do I lose some of my speed? But I think I get the best of both worlds in yeah. this machine, don't I? In this machine, it has a 10,000 RPM spindle, so it can do semi-fast work. So for example, this machine can not only do aluminum style work, it can also do titanium style work, because we can, we can option this machine up to a 15,000 RPM. HSK A100 spindle, or we can have it here as a 10,000 RPM high torque spindle. And it has a, a direct drive um, uh, A and C axis, so that also gives us the ability to do good work in the in a full five axis range. So, and, and, when I, and when I talk about the range of product, we also have gantry style five axis machines as well. So this is just a, a different series than our gantry style, which then all has it in the head, and it's a, it's a big double column style machine. So we have a, really now a complete range of five axis machines from the largest in our portfolio all the way down to the smallest size. You say we now have a complete range and I want to dive back into this yeah. in just a minute. The complete range was added by listening to partnerships exactly. and yeah. I want to get back into that in just a minute. It's how we started. I know it's important to iterate but when I'm looking at this cosmetically Jeff, two things I recognize right away that I absolutely love. One these giant windows. I'm so yep. tired of trying to peek through a, a small little hole to see what's going on. I mean, these yep. windows are amazing. And two, I love how much Z axis space I have yes. in order to be able to do, to put those large, because if I'm gonna have right. a machine this size, if I'm gonna go a thousand millimeters, right? I yep. wanna have the space for my parts. And it looks like this, spindle head allows me to go all the way down to the table keeping my yep. rigidity yep. and accuracy while pulling away from the table and being able to machine big parts as well exactly and, and our machines are uh, height and height scales all the way around so both linear and rotary scales that give us the accuracy in those long uh, stroke ranges that we have in our products so depending on, you know it doesn't matter what size we have they're all going to have height and height scales throughout the range and they're all going to be very accurate and then we have you know, machines with different style tables as well. We have direct drive, we have worm wheel tables. So it really depends on what the customer needs. We can supply all of what they, re what they require depending on the type of machine they need or the parts they're machining. Jeff, you are incredibly familiar with YCM. You've been uh -huh. doing this a little while now. I have. I had the honor and privilege to recently tour the foundry. Yes. Now I bring this nice, up really. because it's beautiful. It's amazing. <laughs> and it's been around for 40 years. Yes. So it's not just started yesterday and they're like, yes. well, let's try it out. No, yeah. it's been around for 40 years. Yeah. So the reason I bring that up is because again, when I see a machine this size, I would make the discussion that it was designed through partnerships for bigger, harder materials, which means I need to trust 
that the vibration is gonna be reduced. Yeah. I don't wanna scrap parts. I don't wanna lose yeah. cycle time. I don't wanna scrap out my, my end mills. I wanna make sure my finish is yeah. good. And the foundry supports all things yes. YCM. That to me is something that should be spoken about. Yeah, we, we obviously we have our own foundry and it's all Meonite cast and all tested through the standards that give us true Meonite. Not only that, our design and engineering team also does full uh, FEA analysis on all of our products. So uh, of that, when it comes to the design and engineering uh, part of the industry. So, so yeah, we, we, uh, we can actually do very good things from our design standpoint as well. All right, let's close this thing out with how we started it, bringing it all full circle when it comes to partnerships and design, right? So you've had a line of machines. I've seen, I've walked into tool and die factories. Yeah. that some of the best in the world that have YCM machines making perfection mirror parts. Yeah. But you want it to grow. You wanted to sprinkle water on it and make this thing yeah. grow, right? And so this machine was actually designed and developed based on a recommendation by some of the partnerships out there. Yep, that's what, that's right. And you know, YCM, I think if you were to look at us 10 years ago, you would have probably said, oh, they're a great three axis machine tool company. That was what right? I used to say. Yep, and, uh, and, and from, I would say the last 10 years or so, uh, we've, we've put our, you know, kickstand down uh, really decided, hey, let's change the way we're thinking about things and really develop and engineer and design and, uh, and um, produce uh, true five axis machining capability. And like I said, not only do we have the C-frame style products, but also this is called the RAM or sometimes the cradle style product. And, but we also have now the uh, 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 double column style products as well. So we have a full range of, of five axis products and we're going to continue to develop. So if something is needed, we're going to listen to our customers again. We're going to continue to develop. And if we see something that might be wrong, like uh, IMTS 2022, we, there was a, there was something that was found on our RX-65 machines that needed a change. We listened, we changed it. Now it's, you know, the, the cat's meow basically of the five axis machine market. So on our RX-65 machine, uh, we now have a 18,000 RPM HSK A63 spindle along with a DD style table. So that's now the creme de la creme of that product. All right, Jeff, I absolutely really enjoy being able to introduce machines like this. We're all very excited worldwide to be able to continue to develop with YCM. Thank you so much yeah, for your, your time today. I know we have more machines to talk about. Yeah, I mean, we we, we're going to enjoy our time in Taiwan, aren't we? Yeah, we are. We always enjoy Taiwan for sure. All right, my friends, this okay. is YCM. This is my buddy, Jeff. This is a massive thousand millimeter machine and uh, we got more coming to you. So stay tuned. Thank you.